We're going to back to more quests and we have left to test and left to test two and left to test three, part one and two. If I get to it today, part two is further down. It's not in the group of this. Now, if you wonder where I ever got the idea for my thumbnails with the little border thing, and no one cares, but that's that's where it was at. Okay, let's get started. Yeah, I'd say we fell pretty far down. Well, we're really tall. Oh, never mind. <laughs> we were up on a little mound of dirt and rubble. Oh, wait. Oh, we gotta interact with the this thing. I forgot this is a proper hammer mount. Power up initiated. Can I get in here? I see a disc. Is this open now since I have the power on? Yes, it does. There's my portal gun. I can portal there at least. Can't portal in there. What about the room that I looked just looked in? Can I do that? Yes, I can. Do I need this for the other room? Maybe. No. <laughs> that does not fit in a computer. Hey, what if I went up? Why don't I try that? Maybe that'll work. There we go. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. So I feel like I gotta fling myself or get up here somehow, because it's the arrow over there. Or I could just walk across, you know, that works too without, you know, gotta pay attention a little bit here. The emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. This looks like a nice little room. Alright, what does this do? Closes that. Oh, there's turrets there. All right. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots to share. Okay, so is there a way to get another cube over here? Or is this just activate the door? So I need two cues for the door. So there is two... Oh, it's over there. Okay. Now how would I get over there exactly? If I take this off here and put it over there, am I going to get shot from that far away? Yes. Yes, I am. Okay. <laughs> what if I just set it here for now? Take it off the laser. Go over there. I guess I can't portal onto that wall right there. Weird. Okay, so let's put this... Actually, is there a spot back there I can hit? No. But that's glass. No wonder why I can't do that. Hmm. Oh, I gotta fling myself. That's what I gotta do. Did not see that. How do I get this out? I didn't think that far into it. Is there a way to shut this off? Oh, that. Okay. How do I get up there? Oh, hey, what if I just, uh, you know, flung myself from there? That would probably make a lot more sense, wouldn't it? Maybe on the way down I should have uh, hit that. Yeah, because how long is that timer? Yeah, so I gotta fling through there, 
press that orange portal there, and then fling myself over. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Take this out. Might want to switch them, might not. Not sure yet. I guess it doesn't matter at the moment. So I just have to figure out a way how to get over there. Although, what is the point of being over there anyways? Stop. I guess I could kill them. If I... Yeah, if I hurry up and do this without getting shot, it would be great. Just need to switch this out. from right here, just so I'm hidden. There we go. Now they're no longer an issue. So I just have to worry about getting up there. I wonder if I angle this into here, what happens? Oh no, that's angled. Oh, okay, I have to go from that way. So if I go here, fling myself over, then I just throw this, like, right there, and I can go across. Uh, I should have kept... Oh, no, there's a, there's a thing here. Okay, we're good. Do I want to put this here, or do I want to take... So that's part of it, and then the other part is this. So I probably do have to switch that. Yeah, switch them out. I'll go over there. Go in here. Because I'm going to want to put that here and step on this. Let's see if I switch to portals now. I can't get. Oh, yeah, I can. I can just repress that. So if I did that, press this, get the cube again. Alright, where are you at? There you are. Take both of them through, set them on the buttons, we should be good to go. I hope. At least done with this room, unless there's more after this. Not really sure. Good. If you feel that a lethal military android has not this. respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. I'm not sure why I held off so long on playing this. But I was, like, it was always on my list, but he just requested it to me, like, a couple weeks ago. So I finally got around to doing it. So let's go on to the next part. I'll probably save, uh, part three. Left 4 Dead 2, 3, part 1 and 2 for another episode. Left 4, did, I just, did I just say Left 4 Dead? Left 2 Test. That's what I meant. Oh, now we're waking up in this? Okay. Are we just dreaming all that? Oh, years ago. Oh, okay. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all Enrichment Center activities, serious injuries may occur. For your own safety, and the safety of others, please refrain from the That's creepy. I'm taking this with me. Never mind. Oh, this is definitely different than the very first room you always have to go through. Thank you for making it different, because everybody just has the normal drop the cube onto the button thing. So that shuts that off. I can press this. We drop this. Go through here. Nice. Thank you for putting a twist on that. I got so tired of doing the same crap over and over again. 
Not, not, not like it wasn't bad, but it's, you know, once you do the same thing 10,000 times, it gets kind of boring. Oh. Should have did that with the cube first. I can drop it off and it'll go over there. There we go. Now it's my turn. Set this right here. We are good. Never mind. Unless you have a plan for building some supercomputer parts in a big hurry, this place isn't going to be safe much longer. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Oh shit. All reactor core safeguards are now not oh. functional. It's a nice task, but I mean, you had to destroy it, so. Good. Now, please return to your bed. Okay. Oh, we're back in present day now. Because I haven't, like, Vietnam flashbacks. To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Let's go here. I wonder if I angle this to right there. Well, once I get it to stay. What's through here? Oh, that. Okay. So wait. Oh, I could have just poured it onto that. Okay, well, hold on. Get that out of here. Let's do that. And that. Although, how am I going to get in there now? <laughs> wait a second. Wait, what did th I don't even remember what this did, honestly. Oh, did that put up this to get up there? Oh, okay. I just wasn't paying attention to that. Let me double check that. Be sure. Yes. Little mini stairs. Although, what I had going on right there might have worked pretty well. Because what, I have to be up here first, and then do that? No, if I get... If I get this in here, set it, like, right here. Hopefully that lines up. And then... I can just go and do this. Step on this. Oh, I can't hit that wall from here. That's right. God damn it. Okay, what if I stop trying to do it from here? Because obviously that's not going to work. Because whenever I do... Uh, whenever I take it in there and I have to stand here to turn this off again. I can't hit that wall. So maybe... Oh, I can hit those. I thought those were too small. Well. Never mind. I think I just figured it out. So I have to get that in there. Right. I need to get that over there, actually. What am I talking about? Okay, let's get this in here. I don't know, like, maybe, like, right there or something. And step on this. Go and put this here. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Now I got it. It's too far back, isn't it? Yep. Too far back. Oh, never mind. Never mind, it actually works. Hold on. So now I gotta do this. And hopefully it works from this angle. God, I hope so. Well done. There we go. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All aperture science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic low power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. Right, so we get this. Put this here. Oh, it shuts this one off. Okay, and then we get this one. It should shut the other one off. Right? Yeah. 
so I, what, take this one off? No, it closes that one. I put one here, though. And take this through. And I hope I'm doing this right. Don't think I am. I mean, I could, I could just, like, I could toss that down there, but that's not it. God, which this this one was from what the right side? I hope so. My my memory just sucks. Please. Yes. Okay. So should I have brought them on the same side first? I think that's what I should have done. Yeah, I should have did it on the same side, because it needs to be both done. Correct? If it's both done at the same time... No, that's not right. Because if I did that, then I'd still have to stand here, and I wouldn't be able to portal on either of the walls. So I fucked up somewhere. Let me reset this. Okay, so I would take this through, right? Set this on the button. Go down, and it was... Which one was it? Yeah, it was blue portal. Blue portal onto here. Take this one through. And... Or, no, wait, no. Oh, wait. Shit. Well, well would I just press this? Since I have this, and then... Uh, blue portal. No, it wasn't blue portal. What, I orange portal here? Put that on the button. So now I can get into there. But if I take either one of these off on either side... Kind of screwed. Do I have to switch them? Maybe I have to swap the cubes on each side and then just press the opposite ones. Because if I have one over here on a button, I can press it and get it over here. I don't know. Oh, you know what? I think, I hope, that I understand what I'm supposed to do now. Because this cube is from that side. I just brought it through and set it on here. If I go and take this through now, right, then this is over here. Set this here. I go back through and I orange portal because I need that side. And then I press this and I should get that. There we go. Okay. These are some cleverly designed little puzzles here. Very, uh, it's, it's throwing me off <laughs> quite a while. They don't look that difficult. But to me, they kind of are. Which is a good thing. Do I go down there? I want to go down there. Fine. Oh, wait. No, I go through here, don't I? Yeah. That's probably just death. I'd rather not try that. Oh, button. I'll take the chair, though. Never mind. It's just stuck on the railing forever. Oh, there's a room I was just in. Cool. Another disc. Get out of here. Quit grabbing the chairs. Oh, I can't go through that door? Damn. Hey, why don't you just go through the green door, you idiot? Instead of, you know, going all the way down there. This is a nice little series you got going here. Is that the end, or is there more? Okay, go pull that lever. Turn that on.
Oh, do I have to, like, fling myself or something? Because, I mean, I can portal here. Or... Go down here and do this. Power up initiated. I mean, if I do this, I can still get in there. Let's go over here, press the button, get our cube. Just a regular cube. Okay, so that shuts off the fizzler. So I definitely want to go get that light bridge. Power up complete. Please tell me I can make that jump. Okay, there we go. Go over. Swap that there. Don't fall into the water. Do that. Put this on the button. And I think that was the door upstairs, right? That's why there's this little thing. Or something, I don't know. I heard something open. Oh, the door's right there, you dummy. Why did I get so obsessed with the other door? Let me guess, I needed the light bridge to work for that part. <laughs> Probably did. Yep, right across. Okay, so I reset this up again, just because I feel like I did it wrong. So... What about if I... Can I make that jump? Because if I could make that jump, then that would make it a lot easier. Or... Actually... A little more over. There you go. So if I could jump over from here on to here, I can definitely jump back. Right? If I get the cube. No, okay. This this definitely has to be portaled in here. What am I thinking? Because if it's in there, I can't go back in and get this. Just set this on the button. So I just have to do it from here. Over. Then to here, yes, okay. And then jump over. Because then I'll have the portal in there and I can go back through here. Back over here and then just lift this up. There we go. Wheatley. Oh, it's a heart. Long time. How have you been? I've been fine. How have you been? Alright, I'm done for today. Those two were amazing. I loved them. I don't know why I waited so long to play them. Then I'll be doing Left to Test 3, Part 1 and 2 in the near future. Maybe not next episode, maybe the episode after that. But I definitely want to just rotate around a couple other maps in between this. But I'm done for today, and I'll see you next time.